For the Make Code Minute today, what I wanted to do was show you how you can use arrays to create your own custom lists of NeoPixels. So a lot of times uh, dealing with Circuit Playground Express in Make Code, we want to do things like light up particular NeoPixels. And if we're trying to light them not just in sort of the zero to nine order, uh, you can get into some pretty complicated math to deal with looping around if you want to go from uh, the fourth one up to the eighth one going over the top of the, the board there. It gets a little complicated. And so what I've done instead is I've created a couple of arrays, and these are just lists of NeoPixel numbers. So you can see here I have an array that goes 21098, and that is the uh, sort of 9 o'clock position, the far left NeoPixel, and then running counterclockwise, or rather running clockwise up across the top. Then I have another array, this is called the B list, and this is 76543, so this runs down the bottom. And uh, then what I'm doing with those lists is when I click either the A button or the B button, I am calling a item in that list, which is easy to call those in order, uh, and then they have their own custom orders that we get to utilize for the effect. So when I press A, you'll see I'm running a red NeoPixel. That's just going to loop endlessly across the top of the board, even though those are funny, weird numbers. Uh, and the same with the B button, I go down across the bottom of the board. Uh, and so let's take a look at that inside of a uh, down shooter here. You should be able to see, yeah, you can see those colors pretty well. Uh, so here, I know my finger will be in the way, as I press the A button, I'm looping through that one list, that array uh, of values, and then when I press the B button, I'm doing the same with the other list. Uh, and so that's a way that you can create unique uh, sets of NeoPixels or other numbers to deal with inside of Make Code. And that is your Make Code Minute.